Salut coders, this is Piski. Welcome back to another tutorial. In this tutorial, we want to verify the email address of a user who is registered on our application. And we are going to use Kicklock Admin Client HSTK. So, yes, you can see this user code with Pisk. The email is not yet verified and verification here, it's no. So we need to make it yes. So let's get started. If you are new to this channel, may kindly subscribe. Click the notification bell so that you'll be notified whenever I upload new video. So in our project, uh, we already created a user and we have this send verify email verification send and it allows it allows a user ID which has been created to clock. So this is the user ID required for you to verify the email. Then the method we using our user resources we need to call this send verify email address and this is the api for send verify email address so we need to call this method and we want to verify the email address so we need to configure if we use this method it won't work because we did not yet configure our smtp so to configure our smtp we need to come to to our room quackers and we go to room settings and we go to email so that an email can be sent so here i want to say no reply you need to add your username of a smtp you can use google smtp but for me i'm using i'm using zo smtp so here you need to enter your username from here we enter your username and here a display name i'll just say no reply so if you if i send an email i don't want people to reply to it so the, i don't check this email address so in smtp i'm using smtp so eu because my account is in eu and the port that i'm using is 587 for this is for zo and i enable start tls and an email will be sent to my email address just for testing because here i'm just i want to test this before we start to use it and this is going to be my my username and password from zo you can use your gmail and you look how to configure gmail smtp so let me test the connection of this user no reply which i created on zo You can see it means our configurations are okay. So I can open the Gmail and see the test message. This is the test message. It shows that my emails are working fine. So my users will be able to receive those emails from our key clock. Then you click save. So after we are done with this, we are okay. We can now go to our application. I want to delete this user. Let's go to user. I want to delete it so that we can create it from scratch. And I just want to copy the email. And I will delete the user. Make sure you uncomment. You uncommented to verify email. So after creating an a user here we will find the user id of that user by using username and then we'll send a verification email and email will be sent here so this is the logic so let's test this on our project and i open my ui let me just reload here so i'll click my endpoint for registration i'll click try out yeah my my username is going to be this is going to be my username and this is my email address my first name i'll just say bisk last name musweet and password is going to be test one two three four so before we test we need to make sure that our email is here the verified should be false let's make this one to be false so that when you create our user 
email verification will be false so let's execute this now you can see we get a success message and if you go here we don't have any error it means email verification is been sent so let's go to our key clock and see our new user let's refresh here you can see the status of email it's unverified so let's check if i so the email is taking time to re, uh, it's taking time to receive to my inbox so let's add an api that a user can click if a user click that send verify email and then the email will be resend again so that api we can call it recent email so what i can do i can come here and create a get mapping or i just say put mapping and you say recent a recent verification email and here it's going to be at request let me say request param string user id and i will make it a void here since it's a void i can remove this email verification and i'll pass the user id and here let's change this to user id since it's a path variable let's copy this and put it here and we are going to call this method and we are going to pass our user id so here i'm supposed to see two endpoints here this one for user id and let me copy the user id from here this user id copy and i'll come with it here try out so in case you receive you didn't receive your email they maybe there's some connection issue with the email so you need to send a a verification again i will execute this and no content we didn't get any response so let's see let's wait if you are going to receive an email the problem that i'm getting here it's because my email is invalid sending the email but this is incorrect email address so i need to create the correct address here so what i can do i need to say try out username code with bisque at gmail.com this is the valid email address that i'm using and i'll say bisk mm, sweet and the password is test one two three four then i can execute this one and i expect to receive an email address let's wait for the email address and this is the link to update my email address in in case that we do not receive an email address and we need to copy let's refresh and this one is the one with the invalid email address i want to delete this user i want to let's copy the user id here and let's come to to our endpoint or let's refresh and let's try our new endpoint which is recent email address and we can put this id and here it's not making sense uh, we will do the, we will fix this soon or let's come here and i will just say recent verification email So let me reload this and this yeah we need to test now it, our api is now making sense now 
then we can post this and we can execute this we are getting 204 it means our it's working fine here we are expecting to have and you can see we have received and we are supposed to use it in 12 hours if i click this link i will click proceed to verify the email address and if you check here our email is not yet verified it's still no so let's proceed so the email has been verified if i come here and reload this you can see the email is now verify, verified and that red is no longer there so if you are new to this channel may you kindly subscribe click the notification bell so that you'll be notified whenever i upload new video salukodas